TeamCity got an exciting new feature called Parallel Tests. Let's check it out. Imagine you have a Maven build configuration, which roughly runs 500 tests during each build run. And now you want to have a super simple way of parallelizing those tests, say, run them in two or three batches. How do you do that? Super simple. Edit the build configuration, build features, add build feature, and choose the parallel test build feature. Now make sure to tell TeamCity how many batches you want to have. Two, three, four, whatever you like. I'm just gonna go with two. When you now run a build, what's gonna happen is that TeamCity runs a tiny auto-generated build chain because it's not just one build that's running now. In fact, it's two builds that are now running. You can see batch number one, batch number two running in parallel. Right, as you can see, batch number one executed 232 tests, batch number two executed 246 tests. How did the test got split? Does it mean that Team City splits them alphabetically? No, what Team City actually does is it splits them by the batch size, so two in this example, and then has a look at all the test classes across the last 10 builds of your project and gets the total test durations for your test classes and make sure to split out, to even out those tests across your batches. So it actually splits them by batch size and also by total duration. Pretty nifty, isn't it? The feature is currently available out of the box for Maven, Gradle and .NET runners. More runners coming soon. That's the parallel test feature. Enjoy.